What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is a free general collective reading, caps are side to everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate. Leave the rest. Um, free oracle card reading for sign of Gemini. This could resonate if you have Gemini any aspects of your chart. Sun, moon, rising, Venus, or they've been having a Jupiter chart. It's very important to only take the messages that resonate and leave the rest. Thanks everybody for all the love and support to the channel. We're at 12,590 subscribers. So thanks so much for all the love and support. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess 05. The link's in the description box below. PayPal only, no cash app, no Venmo. I do not publicly display how much you donate if you choose to uh, donate to my channel uh, for privacy and confidentiality purposes. Um, love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. It helps support a single mama and two uh, kids income stream, one of her income streams. So thanks so much. I really appreciate it. Okay. I did receive a channel message as I was uh, meditating on your um, mid-May of 2022's um, Oracle card energy. And um, the channel messages I received was um, um, the wheels about to start moving very, very fast was the first one. And the second one I heard um, a particular Gemini is about to be subpoenaed in a court case soon regarding a child custody battle. Um, and hidden cameras in someone's house in the past. That is what I heard. So you plug it in, how it resonates. I heard you're not going to want to be there is also what I heard. So you plug it in, how it resonates. So um, the wheel is about to start moving very, very fast for at least one of you guys. Um, that can go in a positive aspect or a negative aspect. Only you know your story, not anybody else. So you have to plug it in, how it resonates. And at least one of you guys, it sounds like in the universe upcoming, is about to be subpoenaed. Um, I heard, and it sounds like somebody else's child custody case, um, child custody battle, child custody case, what have you, um, regarding hidden cameras in somebody else's home in the past. Um, I think they know you know information on this, or you were a part of it, or something of that nature. I heard you're not going to want to be there. But um, it sounds like you're going to be subpoenaed, meaning you're not going to have a choice. So um, only you know your story, not anybody else that's upcoming in the universe for at least one Gemini. You plug it in, how it resonates, if that resonates for you, Gemini. Messages you have signed in soon. Two people in your around your community are about to move soon. It's about to shock the hell out of you. Move and move to move around the same location separately. Okay, I heard two people in your community. Uh, if this resonates for you, Gemini, it sounds like they're about to move separately, like they're not going to move together. It doesn't sound like in the same dwelling space together, but um, they are both going to move soon. But I heard they're going to move. Um, near the same location um, and it sounds like away from the current community or location that y'all all currently reside in um so you plug it in how it resonates it sounds like it might be shocking to you so you plug it in however that resonates it's two people in your y'all all reside in this community together all three of y'all right now but two uh, two two people are about to separately move outside your community outside your location it sounds like they're going to do it separately. 
um, but to around the same location. They're going to go to the same location, uh, but they're going to move separately. I heard, um, I think it's going to shock one of you guys. You plug it in how it resonates. A Gemini is about to have so many things happen to them so, so quickly, so soon. They're about to go through a huge spiritual awakening. Huge. Huge changes. Okay, I heard a Gemini is about to have so many huge things happen to them so quickly. Um, they're about to go through a spiritual awakening. So for one of you guys, it sounds like you're about to go through a spiritual awakening. Um, but it sounds like it's because the universe is about to, um, it's about to pause it. Because there's about to be so many huge things about to happen so soon and so quickly. It sounds like in your life, if this resonates for you, it's about to produce a spiritual awakening. So in you. Uh, and spiritual awakenings, they're really, really good for oneself. They really, really are. Um, they're messy and they never happen in order or happen the way you want them to happen, but they do happen and they happen for reasons. I've went through many of them in my life, um, but they're very useful. They're very useful. Number 55, 58 or four could be very significant numbers in one's life. 55, 58 or four. It could be possible ages of children of yours or somebody you're connected to, possible age of you or somebody you're connected to, possible jersey number, possible lottery number, possible green card number, possible jersey number, possible, um, yeah, 55, 58, or 4. We, um, you could be dealing with um, an earth sign or a fire sign because you have earth sign and fire sign animal spirit cards in here. If you are, they could have a uh, Gemini Libra, uh, not Gemini Libra, um, they could have Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, or Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo in your sun, moon, rising, in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, Orpha, and Benhamer, Jupiter charts. If you are dealing with a fire sign or earth sign. Um, yeah. Snake spirit, time to heal. Rhino spirit, overcome obstacles. Bow, you are highly thought of. Wedge. Someone is trying to come between you and a friend or something you want. Dogs getting together with friends. Transformation healing. Time to heal. A very significant court case is about to come to a, uh, to a close soon for some. For some, a very significant court case is about to begin. Significant child custody battles. One of these involves hidden camera energy of the past and subpoena energy. Okay, so a lot of court case energy in here. So, um, a significant court case, ch child custody battle court case, it sounds like about to come to a close for one. For one, it's about to come start. It's about to start. Uh, one of these child, it sounds like they're both child custody battles. Um, one of them involves hidden camera energy of the past and subpoena energy. So for one, I feel you could be the one being subpoenaed because one of you guys is going to be subpoenaed in somebody's child custody battle case I heard previously in here. For one, it could be your child custody battle case. For some, it could be involving hidden cameras that were in your home or somebody you're connected to's home. Or you could be subpoenaed involving hidden cameras in somebody else's home. However that resonates. But child custody battle energy all over the place in here. One is about to come to a close, it sounds like. One is about to start up. And there is subpoena energy in here. So healing from all these child custody battle energies, hidden camera energies, um, subpoena energies, uh, just healing in general. Uh, hopefully it's healing, positive healing for children. Um I mean, it's really sad. It's sad that people decide to implant cameras in people's, uh, hidden cameras in people's spaces and dwellings and trackers on people's vehicles and things like that. That impedes people's rights and liberties like nobody's business. Overcoming obstacles. Come on. A very significant STD is about to become very significant in a Gemini's life. Very significant. Not getting better, getting worse. 
soon one Gemini is going to go seek medical treatment. Okay. Oh, Lord, this is gross. So you plug it in how it resonates. Okay, I heard a very significant STD is about to become very significant in a, a Gemini's life. It's not getting better. It's getting worse. One of you guys is going to go seek medical treatment soon. So time to heal in this situation is STD getting worse, not better. Uh, maybe you thought it was going to naturally just go away or heal on its own or what have you, if that resonates for you, but it sounds like it's getting worse and not better. So healing in this aspect is going to get medical treatment for the STD. I didn't hear specifically what it was. You plug it in how it resonates. Overcoming obstacles. A particular Pisces will not contact a Gemini back, but they're doing this for strategic reasons. Know this. For some, they don't want the drama. For some, it is the third party situation. They're trying to get you to come, come to them. Know this. Oh, my Lord. So you plug in and how it resonates. Our particular Pisces is not contact, contacting you back for specific reasons. For some of you guys, I heard they just don't want the drama, so I don't feel their third-party energy. I just feel they are somebody in your life that just doesn't want damn drama, and they don't want to contact you or communicate with you because they feel it might situate drama, basically. Um, for some, it is a third-party energy, I heard, and um, so it sounds like a third-party energy of yours or of your past. And they're basically trying to gaslight your ass. They're trying to gaslight your ass to get you to come to them, basically. Um, so overcoming obstacles in this aspect is I think you trying to figure out what you need to do. Are you, you going to cut this third party energy off that's trying to gaslight your ass and get you to come to them? Or are you going to, um, try to heal it with, um, the one that doesn't want drama or, or what have you? Um, but overcoming obstacles with whoever these Piscean energies are in your life. Um, it could be a masculine or femme Pisces. They could have Pisces in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, ortho, moon, hand, energy, your charts. If that resonates for you. Gemini. You are highly thought of. A particular Gemini femme is about to get lots of help out of a very toxic family situation soon. Some you ha some you are single, some you have child and children. Lots of help. Okay, so that's a good one. So you plug it in how it resonates. So one of you guys is in some kind of toxic family dynamic. Uh, some you're single, you have no children it sounds like, like in your care. Some you um, have child or children, it sounds like, in the home. Um, but I heard you're a Gemini fem. You could have Gemini in your sun, sun moon, rising, Venus, or could have been Jupiter charts. But it's a very toxic fi family dynamic. For some, I feel it could be physical violence or, um, or abuse. Um, maybe it's verbal abuse, mental abuse, physical abuse, um, sexual abuse, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. But some kind of definite toxic energy. I feel abuse energy. Um, I didn't hear abuse, but I feel abuse. Um, but I heard you're about to get lots of help to get out of it. Um, you're highly thought of. I think the people that are about to help you think are high, high, think highly of you, and they're about to help you. You're a Gemini fam. Some you have kids in this situation, some you don't. A particular social worker is about to become very significant in a Gemini's life soon. Okay, I heard a particular social worker is about to become very significant in a um, 
Gemini's life soon. So you plug it in how it resonates. Social worker energy. Um, maybe the social worker is going to think highly of you or they do think highly of you. Um, however that resonates. Social worker energy strong. Uh, it sounds like coming up soon in a Gemini's life. Someone is trying to come between you and a friend or something you want. A Libra fraud and a Piscean fraud is about to be exposed very publicly very soon. And a Gemini fraud. For some, you're about to help expose them. Okay, I heard a Libra fraud, a Gemini fraud, and a uh, Piscean fraud. It's about to become very exposed very soon and very publicly. For some of you Geminis, you're about to help expose them. So um, it's another Gemini fraud, um, Libra fraud, and a Piscean fraud. They can have Libra, Gemini, or Pisces in their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Thumb, Midham, or Jupiter charts. But some of you Geminis, I heard you're going to help expose them. They're going to get exposed very publicly. So I don't know if this is public reporting energy compliance call, hotline energy, um, reporting to authorities or police energy, but some kind of exposure exposure publicly of these frauds. They could have um, Gemini, um, Gemini, Pisces, or Libra, and their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Thumb, and Hammer, Jupiter charts. Um, but I, I think they were um, trying to come, I think they frauded you for some of you guys. They frauded you or somebody you care about because they were creating a wedge with the frauding energy. Um, in some shape, form, or fashion. So I think they um, did something to you or somebody you care about, and that's why you're about to expose them. A bitter ex is about to become very significant in a Gemini's life soon. Heavy earth sign energy for some. Heavy fire sign energy for some. Oh my lord. A bitter ex is about to become very, very, very significant in a Gemini's life soon. For some of you guys, your bitter exes are earth signs, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, or a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. They could have Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, or Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, and their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Thumb, Hammer, or Jupiter charts, bitter X energy. They're about to become significant in your life soon, and that would make sense because we have the fire sign, energy, animal, spirit, and the earth sign, um, energy, animal, spirit in here. So you plug it in how it resonates. Dogs getting together with friends. A significant outing to a restaurant is about to become very significant to a Gemini. For some, a significant outing to a bar. For some, a significant outing to a park. Okay, I heard a significant outing to a park for some of you guys, for some a bar, and for some a restaurant is about to become very significant in a Gemini's life. So I think you're going to get together with friends in some shape, form, or fashion at this bar, park, or restaurant is what I'm feeling. But only you know your story, not anybody else. Um, however, that resonates and applies in one's life, Gemini. But I heard specifically a bar, a park, and a restaurant. So one could apply, two plus could apply, none could apply. You plug it in how it resonates. But however this bar, park, or restaurant applies to you, I feel definitely feel it's going to be with friendly type people. Hopefully they're not frenemies. Just saying, just saying. Transformation. Foreclosure energy coming for one particular Gemini. They were hoping it would not go this way, but it is about to go this way. 
Oh, my Lord. Heard foreclosure energy coming for one particular Gemini. They were hoping it would not go this way, but it is about to go this way. So transformation, I think this is spiritual awakening inside yourself because I heard one of you guys was going to have a spiritual awakening soon. It might be because of this foreclosure energy for some of you guys. I heard you were hoping it wouldn't go that way, but it is about to go this way. Um, I think you were trying to prevent it or you were hoping it wouldn't go that way or what have you, but sounds like it's about to. Um, so in this aspect, it's spiritual awakening energy, I think inside yourself, um, is what I'm feeling. Um, for some, you could be dealing with the Scorpio because it's Scorpionic energy. If you are, they could have Scorpio in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, ortho, and Midham, or Jupiter charts, if you are, but definite spiritual awakening energy, if this resonates. Okay, I didn't hear anything else. Healing. A particular Scorpio has got a huge, huge, huge wake up call. Scorpio masculine. Huge wake-up call coming out of darkness. It is about to shock the hell out of you. Shock the hell out of you. They are about to figure out exactly what they want in life, and they're about to go for it. For some, you were hoping it was you were involved, but you are not. You're about to figure this out very soon. Oh, my Lord. So you plug it in, how it resonates. So Scorpionic masculine energy coming in very strong. So for some, I feel you're platonically connected to this Scorpio. For some, I feel you might have romantic feelings towards this Scorpio, um, according to the messages. But you plug it in, how it resonates. But however that resonates and however this applies in your life, because only you know your story, not anybody else. He's coming out of it. He's having a spiritual awakening, too. He's having a transformation and spiritual awakening inside itself, too. It sounds like he just had or he's about to. But however that resonates, I heard he's coming out of the darkness or he's about to come out. I heard he's about to figure out exactly what the hell he wants. So I think he was confused in the past and he didn't know what the hell he wanted. He didn't know up from down. Um, he he was in a very dark place. I'm feeling probably drugs or sex or, um, gam or addictions or gambling or something very toxic was dragging his ass down in some shape, form, or fashion. For some, it could be black magic for all we know. But however that resonates, he's waking up. He's waking up or he's about to wake up. Um, for some, you were hoping he, you would be included in his plans, I heard, moving forward. But I heard you're about to realize you're not. For some, I don't think you care less whether you are or aren't. But for some, I think you like are romantically attracted to him or, or maybe you would just want to be connected to him. But however that resonates, it sounds like you're not going to be. Um, so healing, healing for the Scorpio masculine, healing for the situation, healing for him coming out of this dark place. We're just going to shock the hell out of you. There's a lot of shock energy in here, Gemini, a lot for you. Things are about to start moving very fast, very quickly for you. A lot of shock energy, a lot of changes, um, but healing. And this could be healing in you realizing that he's transforming whoever this person is and however he's connected to your life and that he's moving on. If that resonates for whoever. Lone wolf energy for one Gemini. Lone wolf energy for one Gemini is what I heard. And a, a particular Gemini is about to get a phone call, very angry phone call from an air sign. 
because they're about to have to pay a very, 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 very large sum, a fine, some a fee because of the past. Some a air sign, some a water sign. Okay, and a particular Gemini is about to get a very, very angry phone call for some from a water sign, I heard, some from a air sign. It could be a vascular film water sign, vascular film air sign. They could have Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, or um, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, and their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or Femin, Hammer, Jupiter, Charles, how that applies. But um, it sounds like it hasn't happened yet. It's about to, but they're, it sounds like they're about to call you, Gemini, and basically cry, cry be crapper, sing, complain, and bitch and gripe because for some of these air signs and for some of these water signs, they're going to have to pay a very, very large fee for some a very, very, very large fine because of something that happened in the past. Um, and I feel for some, they might blame you for it or feel you had a part in it, possibly. However, that resonates. Um, they could have Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, or Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, and there's Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North, and Behavior, Jupiter, Charts. But it sounds like upcoming phone call to you, Gemini. They're going to be pissed because they're about, to, I mean, some it's a very, very large fee. Some it's a very, very, very large fine. But however that resonates, I feel they feel you either had a part in having them pay this very, very large fee or fine, or they blame you for it. But some reason they're about to call you and bitch and complain and cry be crap about it. So um, you plug it in how it resonates. All right. Well, I love you guys so much. I hope this helped and namaste.